Right guys, we're doing decline Smith machine chest press now. So for the purpose of this one, the first thing that we've got to do is make sure that our head is lower than our legs again. So we're going to put the seat position so it angles down over so our head slopes down at the ground. Again, if we don't have a decline bench, then have a flat bench, but put some weight plates under the legs where your seat is, but make sure it's safe and sturdy to do so. Right, so we're just going to go five kilos on either side of the Smith machine. And Ashley's going to demonstrate on how to do this. So as you go down, go down really carefully, just in case you do slide down the bench. And again, hand position is paramount on, on this machine. Now, on most Smith machines of today, there's a little mark on the bar. That's where I would recommend putting your pinky finger and that would give you the right width apart. But it depends on how wide your frame is. You might have to adjust your hand position, but don't go too close because again, that would engage more of your triceps. If you go wider, it'll engage more of your shoulders. So get a natural hand position, what is engaging your chest. Now from that point, she's gonna lock this bar off and just note her elbow position here because this is really important as she lowers the bar down. Her elbows stay, stay in this side of the bar. So push up to the sky now, Ashley. So what a lot of people do is when they go down, they bring it like that, which puts an unbelievable amount of pressure on the shoulders. We just need to make sure that it's not too far, folks. If she comes like she is there, she's gonna engage her triceps. So it's just gonna be there. So it's just this side of the bar. So she's gonna take it down and then up. She's gonna hold the squeeze, take it down nice and slow. And then up, hold the squeeze. And this is working the lower part of the chest. Now, breathing again is paramount. She breathes in as she goes down and she's breathing out as she brings the bar to the top. Up and down, we're just gonna do five reps now so you can see this and keep it nice and tight. Breathe and go down and up. Good. Give me three more. Give me two more, that's good. One more, actually. And then this is a Smith machine, so we're gonna lock this off and then she's just gonna bring herself up. This can be done on a free bar. It can be done with dumbbells, whatever you want, but the way we're doing it there was on a Smith machine. It's a bit more controlled, but by all means, do that on a, on a free bar, an Olympic bar, absolutely fine, but the same principles apply.